is going okay hey guys <laughs> hey vlog <laughs> it is this is gonna be the start of the vlog hey vlog, vlog. it is three at night and emma just emma and blake actually and ada just picked me up did you win your bingo though and i haven't finished my bingo but what i have done is i've done a shot uh got a random stranger with the got a photo with a random stranger with the first name of my name I've wet Willy to Stranger. Oh, goodness. And I proposed to a stranger. Cool. We will see you maybe during the week or the next week. Hold on, I'm just going to show them your outfit. So you're getting a whole show over here. <laughs> Peace out. Peace. Crumpet time. I'm literally obsessed with this new Coquito Choc Chip Swell Peanut Butter. Oh, and I'm gonna do a comp prep update at the end of this video. Like, can you remind me, please? Because things have changed, obviously, because I'm eating crumpets. But do you wanna tell them what we're doing today, Blake? I need to buy some more honey. We have got a photo shoot. And you're a bit more excited about this one than you were your last one. No, oh, yeah, I was excited about the other one. I was just nervous. Yeah, last time Blake had a photo shoot. Well, his only photo shoot with Corey. <laughs> he was literally shitting Blake. <laughs> it was the funniest thing ever. Now, I got my, oh I got my C-phones on too. Hello. Do a bit of a fit check. Muscle Republic. Muscle Republic, as always. Oversized tea. I might get my cropped oversized tee, that could be cute. Yeah. But would that be too matchy matchy, do you reckon? We already are matchy. Mm, true. And then we're also going to half baked. Potentially getting a cookie. Yeah. A loaded cookie. Those crumpets. Like, have you ever seen anything? So freaking good. We're gonna eat these and go. Yum! Mwah. I love the crumpets. <laughs> the lighting's really bad, but we're going. Do you have car keys? Yes. <laughs> oh, she's it's nipping. so cold. She's nipping. Look, I got goosebumps on my legs. Fucking frozen. Off to, where are we going? Lady Luck? Get a coffee? Hey guys, welcome to my YouTube channel. No, oh, is that vibrating logs? Is that annoying? So, I am doing this, is gonna be my comp prep update. So, obviously, pulled out of comp, sadly. Very sad about it, very annoyed about it. Um, five weeks ago. And we were going to, we continued to prep. Um, so I kept like prepping everything until Friday just passed. So I don't even know what the date was on Friday. Like the first weekend of October. Um, purely based off the fact that we want to start my reverse now. So, cause I'm still going to the Gold Coast on a holiday. Um, so when I get to the Gold Coast, I'm like in a lot better position than say just like ending my diet on 1400 calories. So my reverse started on Friday. I got like a meal off and then slept so bad Saturday night and then woke up this morning and we're all back to normal, which is good. So yeah, that is kind of like the little update. So my calories are at like 1900. Um, still got cardio, still got 20,000 steps, um, and then that's going to slowly taper back and my food is going to slowly taper up, which I'm really excited for, but it's going to be very slow because, yeah, we all know what happened last comp, didn't we? <coughs> but yeah, no, it's actually really good to be in, like, a decent position with food, if that makes sense. But yeah, last comp, I really struggled, so it is kind of good to have some really good kind of feelings and eating habits rolling um, and nothing's kind of really alarming which is which is nice and a good coach and a good coach yeah definitely having Thanks, definitely having a good coach helps <laughs> that was a lot but yeah so that's just kind of our vibe we're just reversing everything's going good 
feels weird eating more food feels weird drinking Sprite no sugar I'm still not having a Coke no sugar till I get to the Gold Coast and I do it with G we're gonna crack open a monster today my first monster and my stomach is going to hate it <laughs> but I'm very excited not dieting anymore no, it didn't phase me didn't phase you why would it phase me for that just means um, we didn't have to spend so much on Friday night takeaway. Oh, yeah. And then, but my groceries were so expensive. Yeah. I was spending like $50 every two days at Woolworths on like just whole Salads. food. Salads. Salads, yeah. Literally, <laughs> butter, lettuce, cherry tomatoes, cucumber, feta, chicken and beef. That's all I was eating. And no joke, my grocery bill was over $200 a week on just that stuff. Like it's actually crazy how expensive fresh food is. Did you say it should just be free? It should be free. Yeah, I did a TikTok and anything that like is good for you should be free. Water should be free. Fresh food should be free. Don't you agree? To a point, yes. To a point, he says. Yeah, yeah can we get a veggie patch? Uh, yeah, I guess so. Yeah, okay. So yeah, that's my little update, but not too exciting, but also really exciting, but also really scary, but also very exciting. Maybe I do comp. You should do comp. Maybe. Yeah? <laughs> yeah? <laughs> Well, to be continued. We're here, bitches. <laughs> We're vlogging today, guys. Oh, yeah, we are. This boy. is Corey. <laughs> hey, Corey. Hello, hello. Right on the face. Hey, yeah, how's it going? This is his professional camera. I wouldn't call it professional. <laughs> yeah, professional cameraman. Hi. Mike, obviously. And then right away. Beautiful. Major slave. Let's go. <laughs> so shoot is finito. Now we are heading to Half Baked Cafe to yeah, get buddy. a loaded cookie. Loaded cookie and a coffee. I'm so another coffee. Yeah, I could go yeah. for another coffee. Okay. Okay. Can't get a cookie. Are we getting a coffee. box of cookies? Well, I think we should get Ash and Jack some. Okay. Maybe Layla some too. Yeah. We're getting the whole the whole squad some. Fuck. Okay, we'll stay tuned for that. <laughs> but how did you think the shoot went? Yeah, good. good. It was really fun. Yeah, Corey. Corey's an absolute bloody magician. Yeah, he's you just got to stand there. He says he's just a button pusher, but he's more than just a button pusher. <laughs> no, he's good. <laughs> he's good to work with. He's fun. So yeah. He's ex army too. Yeah, that's, that's why, why Blake I likes him because they su support your vets. Army birdies. <laughs> but okay, I'll see you at half bake. Bye. Ah. <laughs> Front and center, baby. Hell Let's yeah. go. I can't believe this is going to be like my first post prep treat. What the hell? We got six cookies. Ooh. And I'm gonna eat them all down here. We'll find you. Ah, uh, totally right. I got this stuff. Oh, I'm so excited. Sorry. Thoughts? <laughs> 10 out of 10. Mm. Well deserved. Mwah. Chef's kiss. Got a Mars bar or something. Oh my god. <laughs> smell <laughs> test? <laughs> What's our smell? Two weeks. Oh. I'm doing two shows. Oh, oh it's like crusty but gooey on the center. Like <laughs> <laughs> oh, we got some for the friends. I've never heard like. So I'm on FaceTime with G and we are doing our <laughs> first monster together. One. Oh, that tastes so good. We went to Canada's the warehouse. We don't have it in that bottle, which is really annoying. So here's a little bit of a haul of what we got. I'm completely out of perfume, so I got Giorgio Armani C. This is my all-time favorite. I only got the small bottle because it's so expensive. And then I got the Ariana Grande Cloud, just as a bit more of a 
affordable everyday option because obviously this it's just not doable for everyday vibes. Um, deodorant at Chemist Warehouse is so much cheaper. And then Blake got some magnesium. I got some tan remover because it was half price. And then Blake also got some vitamin D. So yeah, that is it. And then we also have a box of cookies for our friends. Obviously I had my cookie before. So now we've got to get some health. I might have like a salad because I still have a reverse diet. Which is exciting. Um, so I've just got butter leaf lettuce. Mm, I didn't have much crunch. I've got cucumbers. Now, yes, this is an excessive salad, but I am quite hungry, so I prefer to make a big salad loaded with lots of goodness than snack and pick at random stuff. I'm gonna do some cherry tomatoes. I also have zucchini and pumpkin in the microwave as well. Sorry, chicken's in the microwave, zucchini and onion are in the air fryer. Oh my god, can you tell I'm hungry? Um, so yeah, just adding some red onion to the mix. I'm gonna add some balsamic glaze. I'm like obsessed with this stuff. And some low fat mayo. And then I'll mix it. I don't know why I got this out. That's not going in the salad. 20 grams of feta. Yes. Seasoning is this mingles used me on everything seasoning and obviously pink salt because pink salt is like the best thing to ever exist. That's one big salad. Chicken. I pre cook like all my protein, so I'm gonna just have to essentially add it in. I love pom pom. The biggest salad you ever did see, but I'm gonna go eat this. Mm. In the sun. Don't forget to drink water. I have just been to Woolworths to do a bit of a grocery top up um, for my reverse. Now, going into a reverse diet last post comp, I really struggled. I yeah, dealt with a lot of emotions arise that were kind of swept under the carpet. And it's only been two days this since this post comp, but I did a lot of work in my off season of two years to really build my mental health, my relationship with food. And it has been really evident these past two days that the work that I've been putting in and continue to put in is really paying off. And I am really proud of myself about how I've kind of dealt with the past two days emotionally and mentally. Um, if anything, I'm kind of really surprised myself the past four weeks when I continued on with prep, even without a show. So I think definitely not having the show high has helped my switch from diet to reverse. Um, but my food is, <laughs> as you can like roughly see, going to be pretty boring moving into this week. So swapping corn thins for crumpets um, as a pre-workout with honey and the new Mavis peanut butter. Um, obviously reintroducing Sprite No Sugs and Monsters, which I'm really excited about in moderation, not abusing them like last time. Um, oats for breakfast with some walnuts and some peaches and blueberries rather than apples for a bit more carbs. Um, lunch is a loaded chicken salad with like pumpkin, zucchini, lettuce, aioli, feta, cucumber, tomato, I think I said that. Don't know what else. Um, and then dinner is going to be the same, but with beans and beef mints, and then obviously some seasonings and some sauce. Um, dessert slash post dinner is going to be a yoga bowl, and then what else? I'm gonna have some wheat bix in there as well. So yeah, everything's pretty boring and the same, but that is what's going to honestly help me get through the next few weeks, where everything is a bit more touch and go. Um, and it's kind of gotten me into the place where I can have boxes of treats 
like this, sitting in the house and just really be okay with that because yeah, last post comp, as I said, I really struggled in, in a lot of areas because it was something that I had never navigated or known what to do or how to do it. So yeah, having an amazing coach and having a game plan plays a huge role, obviously, but bring on this next freaking phase. Honestly, I'm so ready and excited, but also really scared and nervous, if I'm honest. One thing I am very excited for is my grocery bill to not be so freaking expensive. This is my literal love language. Like Someone eat cookies, bro. <laughs> <laughs> oh, buddy. <laughs> Mm -hmm. That's next level good. This is a caramel. Oh. 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 Bye friends. Bye. Happy Sunday. Have a good week. <laughs> <laughs>